Hey boys and girls, Mr. Neary here. Today, I'm going to show you how to get into your email account. The first thing I need you to do is log in to My Cherry Creek. I have already logged in ahead of time. So I'm at my home page. If I go down here and click home, you'll have um, a home page also, but yours will look a little different because you might have got, not have gone into some things I have. But you're going to look for Outlook Creek Mail. This is the icon. If you don't see it in your home, you might go over to um, My Productivity and look for the envelope here. So here's mine. You'll find your envelope and open it. Now, once you get in, if this is the first time you've been in, you do have an email account. It's been set up for you, and this is probably the first time you've been in. You'll notice that you do have a lot of emails. They've been coming to you automatically over the last few years. Um, you can delete them if you go to the trash can and get rid of all the ones you don't need, but we won't do that right now. You can do that on your own later. I want you to look up here at the top. So we're in My Cherry Creek, your tabs, and then we're in email. The next thing I want you to do is go back to My Cherry Creek and we're going to open up your Google Drive account because that's where we stored your homework to collect all the email addresses. So I'm going to click on My Cherry Creek. I'm going to go and find Google Drive. And I'm going to click on Recent. And here is the email address sheet I have. You'll find yours and open your copy. Remember, we named it copy and we put your name behind it. So this is mine. I'm going to go down here and I see that I have my first person, Sally Neary, Sally Neary22 at yahoo.com is the email. I'm going to take this and put it in my email account. So now I'm going to come back up here to email. I'm going to go down to the bottom and I'm going to go to people. This icon right here is your people. This is going to be your private email address for people you have in your account. So when I get mine up, obviously I have some people here, but I'm going to go over here to new contact. You'll remember that my first person's name was Sally Neary. First name, last name, email address. So I'm going to come back to my copy my email sheet. I can go like this, or I could just type it. I can copy that, Control C, and I can come back, and I can do a Control V. I can come back to my sheet. Now, like I said, you could just uh, go ahead and just type these. But if you want to practice copying and Velcroing, that's great. Command V for Velcro. And now I'll go back and just get my email address. So Sally's email address is right here. I go Control C, I come back, go down to email address, and now I could do a Control V for Velcro. And now I have Sally Neary. Salinary at yahoo.com. I'll go down here and hit create. And it just added Sally Neary, and there's the email address. You'll go to your next person now, and you'll do the exact same thing for everybody in this email sheet. Just copy and paste all of them. Just don't forget when you're done. Just hit create and eat, add each person. That's how you add people to your email account.